the gun sign has been given by Wellen Nicholson at the top of the flag stand, just about set to go. Let's set the field for you once again. 98 of Russell Fleeman alongside the 28 of Lee Langford. That's Chevrolet versus Ford on the front row. The 85 of Kevin Perry starts alongside the 8. Another Chevy versus Ford row. That's the 8 of Mark Wingo on the outside. The 41 of John Harrison starts alongside the white 41 of Jimmy Price. Row number three, it's the 21 of Junior Hardy alongside the 41. Troubles for John Harrison. He has dropped down to the inside of the racetrack. Looks like he's letting everything go by him as we get ready for the start. Russell Lehman out early with the 28 of Lee Langford tucking in right behind him there. The 8 of Mark Wingo. He was our last winner here at Pete State Speedway in the late model stock division. Here comes the 41 of Jimmy Price in the
trying to chase down Russell Clayman. Clayman, former track champion here at Pete Stank Field. He's trying to slow the game and take this race away from him. Travis Price will move up in the 79 to take his place in line. Oh, stacking them up down in turn four, but uh, we do get going. Turn number four right now. Russell Fleeman makes his way by. He's got the 28 of Lee Langford just behind him. Keith Barrett looking down to the inside right now of the 79 of Travis Price. Also making a look to the inside. The 21 of Junior Hardy trying to make a look to the inside of his teammate. The 41 of Jimmy Price as they work off turn number two. 85 of Kevin Ferry still running strong. He's right behind the number eight of Mark Wingo. And Lee Langford has tightened it up on the 98 of Russell Fleeman once again. That's the battle for the lead as they head into turn number two. Here goes Langford down to the inside. As Fleeman moves up the racetrack, Lee Langford takes the lead. Midway of the back straightaway, it's Lee Langford going for the lead right now. Chad Atha in the pits in the number four on that lap. Here goes Fleeman looking down low once again, but it's going to be Langford with his first lead of the evening in the number 28 car here on lap 20. Setting sail as the Ford Taurus Langford trucking machine out in front of the 98 of Russell Fleeman. Meanwhile, the number 85, Kevin Perry, working up on the back bumper of the 8 of Mark Wingo as they head into turn number one. Jimmy Price now all alone. Jimmy Price in the number 41 runs in fifth. And just behind him, the 32 of Keith Barrett, Dennis Jr. Hardy battling the 79 of Travis Price.
27 laps complete. Laps tonight for the late model stock. Super late models yet to go this evening here on July 4th. Let's watch them. Lee Langford, Russell Fleeman, Mark Wingo, the top three as they come off turn four. Nice working on the high side of Kevin Perry. Trying to take the spot away. Price will move up to fourth. Battling back on the inside. Two laps to go as they work their way by. It's still Lee Langford up front. Rob Freeman in second spot. Flag coming out for Lee Langford off turn number four. Checkered flag. Not Russell Fleet just second. good race for you. You got around Russell Fleeman and then you set out and I'm sure the caution was not something you were looking forward to. No, we had a good run going and uh, our car was good on long runs. Russell was strong. I was beginning to wonder there at the beginning if we were going to be able to stay with him because he, he pulled out five or six car lengths. But I noticed his car started to pick up a push. Uh, I noticed his front wheel turned to the left and it looked like it got worse. I thought he had a tire going down and I thought, well, here's our lucky break. 
We got by him. Uh, I'd like to thank uh, all my crew. I'd like to thank my dad and Richard Law for making all this possible. We brought this car out. We weren't ready uh, two races ago, and then uh, we went home and worked on it, and we came out the last race and sat on the pole and was leading the race and had more trouble. So we were kind of scared coming in tonight, you know, wondering what was going to happen this week. But uh, we, uh, we got lucky, and uh, we had a good run. Well, congratulations. Big win for you, ladies and gentlemen. It's the Ford of Lee Langford back in victory lane tonight here at Peach State Speed. Jaggered flag. Not even Russell Fleming. Just second.